You want to wear it? You want to wear it? We got one, man. Have you got an extra bow tie? Yeah. Let's do it. Uh -huh. Quick. Yeah, it'll be like two minutes. Where is it at? Do you have one? Yeah, it's in my backpack right there. Get, get a kumsin. Uh, Let's do it. I mean, yes. <laughs> and re and re roll the sleeves up because we don't have cuff links. <laughs> This is KEXP. It's 90.3 FM in Seattle, Washington. And around the world, we're KEXP.org. We're about to get into some live music. I've got a band coming up from Los Angeles, California, Chicano Batman. Thank you so much for joining us today. Thank you for having us. Thank Please play some music. Take a trip along with us The road ain't breaking what we must In order to feel lost A breeze in the cloud Creating, flooding our memory Memory is all we have We have none, we sink in the ground Searching like most for our minds Melting into the land But so we Make me what was the first words I said And why did I say them? Make me you know cause you melt in my bones and my brain I see you late at night when I dream Make me you are my warm blanket that leaves me when I wake yeah. Please don't call when I call That leaves me when I wake
music here on KEXP Chicano Batman title track there to the latest full lake cycles of existential rhyme thank you so much for joining us here at KEXP today thank you for having us thank you. sounding wonderful I'm a little embarrassed you know that thing when you show up to work and you're wearing the same t-shirt as like one of your co-workers yeah that's yeah. kind of happened today <laughs> <laughs> once again this is Chicano Batman Coming up from Los Angeles, California, doing some touring right now with Alabama Shakes, correct? And, and some solo dates, too. Yeah, we are, actually. Um, it's definitely a pleasure and an honor, honor to be with, like, s- the Alabama Shakes, y'all. Really, the uh, just pushing soul music and, and making it making it happen, really. So it's 
we just it's just a bless it's just a blessing for us and uh you know we're from LA you know uh, much love to all our people um much love to everybody out there much love to Seattle first time Chicano Batman's made it up here right on well speaking of soul music that's part of what you guys are doing here this is definitely soul music there's the uh Chicano in the name, and, and that's there, but it's just as much psych and soul as anything else. Tell me a bit about how you came to be a band doing the sound. Well, really, there's soul music all around the world, you know what I'm saying? I mean, James Brown influenced everybody, you know, whether it's from Mexico, whether it's from Brazil, whether it's from Saigon, you know? And so for us, uh, that's part of our that's part of our history, you know, being from, from Latin America, our, 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 our families. Um, being here you know just we have all kinds of records from those from those places and you know there's music from mexico that sounds like james brown and so it's just like we're just trying to bring that flavor and, and have everybody understand that it's just like a you know there's there's a root to all music you know and that that black music really spread around the world and so we're just play, paying homage to to the roots of, of all that music most definitely and i've heard you're real influenced by classic brazilian sounds is that true yeah on the way over definitely, here definitely yeah a lot of Tropicalia stuff, late 60s, early 70s, Caetano Velosos, Mutanchis, uh, that kind of thing. It's just um, uh, fighting against the, the norm. You know, it's, it's a non-conventional revolution, you know. And so the music, when it takes that direction, then there's no telling what can happen, you know, how it can inspire, how it can change things. So that's like, that's the root of, of change. Because really it's all about art and creativity, you know what I'm saying? And so we're just trying to be, pay art, you know. Just put our grain of, of, of sand in that, in, the, in that legacy. Were you friends in Los Angeles before you came together to play music? Kind of, not really. You know, it's like when you see him at a party and you have a beer. Uh -huh. You know, that's acquaintance. Right. Party acquaintance. Yeah. Well, whose idea was it to, to pick up some instruments and, and, and make some songs? It was Bardo. He invited me to jam out to some of, his, uh, some of his songs one time. And I showed up with a guitar. He's a guitar player. I'm a guitar player. We had Gabriel. He said, I got a drummer that plays Colombian rhythms and Brazilian rhythms. So then, uh, you know, he, he turned out to play organ. I turned out playing bass. And then later we got Carlos Arevalo. And uh, <laughs> it's just, I don't know. We, it is not, not, not our approach to creating a band we generally would. We just picked up other instruments we don't play in. And then we just flew with it. Nice. And it worked out very well. And yeah. you've put out a couple EPs and a couple full lengths right. as well. I, I can't remember who sent me the, the first EP. It might have been the guys from um, Las Cafeteras, or, or maybe one of y'all. Okay. And uh, I loved it right away, and I've been playing it on the show. And now you're a member. And now I'm a member. <laughs> I'm going to be on the next EP. There we go. At least on the cover. <coughs> and I mentioned you, you were playing with Alabama. So I, I, I've been playing for you a while, but people have... A lot of people have been hearing your music recently because of some, some great touring with Alabama Shakes. Also, you, you did um, some dates with, with Jack White. That's right. And uh, through the keyboardist, no? Yeah. Actually, we knew him since like 2009. He's from Long Beach. Uh-huh. And so, um, so, yeah, he has a side project called the, the Free Moral Agents. He had, he had it. Unfortunately, he passed. Mm -hmm. It was very heavy for, for the music community, you know, here in, in the United States, everywhere, really. And... Um, <clears throat> But yeah, he was our connection. He hit me up through like MySpace back in the day, and he was just like, um, "We're gonna play, you know, the show in Long Beach. We want you to open for us." So, so that's how we started that that uh, conversation with with uh, with uh, with Ike. And so uh, we're definitely blessed by him. And and actually, our latest music we're gonna play uh, on a song. It's called Black Lipstick. Our next song is uh, through him. He was gonna produce that song. But because he passed away, you know, we decided to to pay homage to him with that song. But also, you know, he toured with Jack White. <coughs> he was playing keys with him, so he everywhere he w on tour with Jack White. When we were on tour with them, everybody would tell us, you know, he would he would wear the shirt. He would wear like he would wear like our bat symbol and stuff. And so, uh, so yeah, he just kind of repped us, and that's kind of how it happened. Very cool. Obviously, he was a big fan of of the great music, which is amazing. You also did Coachella this year, which I thought was great. How did that go? It went well. We played at 1 p.m. We played early. We were the first band to play on Sunday. We did both Sundays, obviously. Um, but uh, it was cool. You know, we just, people were wearing our shirts as we, you know, 10 minutes before we started playing. Um, and so that's, you know, it was just a blessing, you know, for us. You know, it's, it's all a blessing and it's, uh, uh, everything goes full circle, you know. And, uh, yeah, you know, we had a good, definitely good, had a good crowd. We came out on Camp Magazine, uh, which is kind of like a magazine there for, for folks uh, that are camping there. Um, it's a nice magazine. 
It's actually where uh, Brittany from from the Alabama Shakes saw our saw us and actually how they connected, how they first heard of us and had you know planted the seed in them, getting us to tour with them. Awesome. And I wanted to ask you about uh, another festival because I missed it, and it was the first one. It was in Chicago a couple months back, Rito Fest, which was, I think, the first of its kind really here in the States to do a big festival of nothing but modern Latin sounds. Right. What was the vibe like there? How was it? It was really cool. It was amazing. Like, you know, you had like side projects from Los Amigos Invisibles, for example. You had also Motley played, you know, just some of the classic musicians, Cafe Tacuba, you know, really, really like staples of 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 just modern music, really. Cafe Tacuba to me is just like, is an amazing band. Um, so yeah, just all kinds of, of really amazing groups and uh, we had a great time out there. I hope to see more of that stuff happening. Uh, there's also Supersonico now in Los Angeles and we're, we're seeing more and more interest specifically in modern Latin sounds, but like you said, it, it's just more that this music is also just music. It's yeah. just hip-hop, it's just rock, like a, right. a band from Seattle is, or a band that sings solely in English is. Um, it's it's being more accepted, and and yeah. that's amazing. Yeah, I mean, you know, it's, it's, it's modernity. You know, we come through history, right? The music, music history is the history of, of economics, of sociology, all those things. And so, uh, you know, now is the time where everything is, is, is uniting, where people are seeing things for what they are, not for what they have been taught they are. You know what I'm saying? Not necessarily where yeah. it comes from or who the people are or yeah. their roots, just that it's good quality music. Yeah, or, or not basically having these preconceived notions of what those things are. Exactly. Once again, we're talking with Chicano Batman playing with us up from Los Angeles. And you say you have a new song for us today? Yeah, we plan to release it soon. Um, it's called Black Lipstick. And uh, whenever you guys are ready, we'll play it. I'm ready. I'd like to hear it.
tear it apart She'll tear it Chicano Batman, live on KEXP. This next song is off our first album. It's called Soñatl.
Discover new music at listenerpoweredkexp.org.